All right, here we go. Summer is right around the corner. The fishing's heating up. So I'll do a video on some cool fishing spots in Ocean City. Uh, they're all pretty well known. If you're from the area or you come here a lot on vacation, you'll know exactly where they are. Uh, but for those that don't, this video will help you out a lot. So I'm on Golf Course Road. I'm coming up to a four-way stop. The Commercial Harbor is right in front of me. That's Sunset Marina, uh, Harborside Bar and Grill. Uh, is over there pretty well known crab alley so i made the left and if i go all the way to the end of this road there's a little beach down there at the end it's called stinky beach so here's the parking lot to it uh ocean city's right across there this is actually down by the 50 bridge is where it is you can see the 50 bridge right in front of me it's right there so here is stinky beach uh it is pretty shallow back there so you um so you just kind of have to kind of feel your spots out and find out where to cast. But that's it. That's Stinky Beach. All right, on to the next one. Another spot that I'm going over right now and where you can actually see Stinky Beach is the 50 Bridge. A lot of people do fish this. Um, if you got to use a heavier pole. Uh, and if you do catch a big one, see here's some people going now. If you do catch a big one, you do need a net to, uh, uh, to bring it up. Stinky Beach is right there. That's it. Where all those people are in that big house right there on the corner. That's right there. So the next one I'm going to take you to is actually right over, uh, right over there. It's uh, the Coast Guard Station. All right. See you in a second. So one of the next places to go is right next to the Coast Guard Station, and right at the end is a little fishing pier uh, and it's actually directly across from stinky beach so but this is one of my favorite spots to go to be honest um, you can cast right out there uh, not too far past that little seawall that goes to the coast guard station and there are flounder in there boats will drift back and forth through here uh, for flounder too, but this is a good spot. I do like this one. Uh, the next one, uh, I don't think I'm going to drive down to the next one. It's pretty obvious. It's right uh, at the inlet, right along the uh, Oceanic Motel, um, the inlet wall, the sea wall right there. You can fish that. So two of the other areas that people fish uh, are the beach, all along the beach. Uh, you really don't have to cast out far, I'd say 25 yards, if that. Um, the fish will kind of hunker down in there. A flounder too. So uh, check the description below for the rules for that. There are specific rules for fishing the beach. You can't just go out in the middle of the day right next to a bunch of people and start fishing. Uh, you will get in trouble for that so check the description i'll put the rules for it um as far as the other one it's the jetty at the end of the uh inlet wall uh people go out there and they fish out there too so uh right now i am headed to ninth street ninth street has a uh little little fishing pier uh crabbing too so i'll show you that one right now All right, so I'm coming up on 9th Street now. Um, some of these places are free fishing places. You don't need a fishing license. You can fish fish there, uh, but some of them are. So, and you do have to have a fishing license. So I will put a, uh, I will put in the description below where you, there are free fishing places are, just so you can see. Uh, this is 9th Street. And it's up here over there where the two people are fishing right at the very end. Uh, that's mostly where the people fish. There's another little cutout that's right in front. That one is uh, more so for crabbing. People are crabbing over there. So that's 9th Street. And then I'm going to run down to the new Cambria Hotel. That's another good spot. And then show you 2nd through 4th Street. Alright, right behind the beach ball uh, water tower. 
is 2nd Street, 2nd through 4th Street. This is a free fishing zone and it's busy all the time. So uh, sometimes you can find a spot, sometimes you can't. The sign even says it in front, free fishing. Um, it's packed down here today. It's Memorial Day weekend, so everybody's kind of out here. But um, yeah, this is a, a free fishing spot. Uh, it's a memorial reef that's down there. I think the reef was for a longtime employee of Ocean City. Um, so expect a lot of snags down here if you're trying to bottom fish. But this is it, 2nd through 4th Street. It goes all the way down there. And then the next one is the new Cambria Hotel. I'll run down there real quick. The new Cambria Hotel, uh, it's right next to the 50 Bridge, the Lazy Lizard. Uh, you can park down there and fish all along the back. They, they put in a brand new, uh, like a little deck boardwalk type thing. Um, and you can actually go fish back there too. Uh, there's also another spot, I'll show you where it is. Right in front of me is the new dock, it's right here. That's what they just put in. So you can fish all that, and there's obviously you see people fishing there. So that's it, that's a new one. Alright, on to the next one. All right, next fishing spot that I'm at, I'm at the 125th Street Park. The Ocean City Recreational Complex is right here. And all the way in the back, there's a uh, fishing pier. Um, I would not expect to catch a whole lot of huge things back here because it is pretty shallow as you go up towards like Fenwick and all that, but the pier is right there. And it goes all the way in the back um, there's crabbing too there's some pretty good crabbing a lot of people talk about the crabbing back here all right I got one more spot and that's it all right so the last public fishing spot uh, that I have is the Isle of Wight if you're not familiar with the Isle of Wight I'm on uh, 90 Route 90, leaving Ocean City, going towards uh, Ocean Pines. Uh, halfway through is the island right there, Isle of Wight. It's, uh, you can hunt on this side, and that side is like camping and, uh, uh, or not camping, I'm sorry, uh, like a picnic area. They got the crab pier that goes out that way. All of this is extremely shallow, by the way, all out here. Uh, but on the very end right there is a fishing pier uh, it's not really used much just because it's so shallow so you can see the pier as we drive by it's right there uh, the downfall to it you at the red light up here you have to park and then walk all the way across to the the pier so if you do have uh, a lot of equipment it can be kind of a long walk so uh, if you decide to fish it you know, there might be some a uh, couple flounder things hanging around trying to get some bait small bait fish but um just pack lightly because it does get heavy uh, other than that there's obviously tons and tons of places to fish in ocean city um but these are the main public ones that everybody uses a lot uh it, that are the most common to go to so if you're just looking for a quick place to go these are, are uh, obviously yeah the, the most used i should say but um really anywhere on the bay side any of those dead end streets you can fish down there there's obviously spots all over the place but uh, i hope you like it and if you do decide to go fishing please let me know what you caught and where you caught it would love to hear uh what you guys catch and uh, hopefully, hopefully catch the big one. So, all right. Thanks for watching. I'll see you later.